Joe from One Up Reviews and today we've got a sneaker review and an unboxing of the Vans Fairlane. Before we get into this review guys, if you're new to our channel, remember to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you never miss any of our latest reviews. Slap that thumbs up, we want to see those likes, it helps us with the algorithms. Drop some love in the comment section below. We try our best to reply to every single comment that's thrown out our way. I just want to take this time and opportunity to thank our subscribers, new and old. Without you guys, we can't do this, so thank you. Let's get into it. So today we've got a look at the Vans Fairlane and we got these in the true white colorway in a US men's 8.5, US women's 10, it's a UK men's 7.5 and it's a European 41. Let's get on boxing and here they are. It is your traditional Vans skate shoe. I mean, the majority of Vans lines are made for skating in mind, but this is quite different to your typical vans even though they have the old school feel. We'll start with the outsole, so this outsole is where it's a bit different. Usually you see the waffle outsole but you've got a different one, you've got a Vans logo there, it's made out of all rubber, lots of traction, grip there. Moving along on to the midsole unit, so that midsole is just a continuation of the outsole, so it just moves itself up, it's the rubber cup sole at the end of the day. Moving along onto the uppers, so again, as I mentioned before, it reminds me of an Vans old school. So you've got the black strip here, that is synonymous with an old school van. I mean, the name Fairlane, come up, reminds me of Fairfax in California, and that's a big skate scene. Obviously, that's where Supreme is in LA. I mean, the colors as well, which just reminds me of the skate scene. Well, when I think of skate, I think of Tony Hawk, and when I think of Tony Hawk, I think of the music that was in Tony Hawk. Pro Skater, it's Pro Skater. And there was a lot of ska, and ska punk, usually they have that checkerboard, and that checkerboard is Vans. So it's a lot of skate references, if you can see where my mind is going to. So again, in this white and black colorway, like the checkerboards. Uh, padded tongue here, it's an all leather wrapper right there, perforations in the toe box at the front, you can see it there. Again, padded tongue, flat laces there. Medial and lateral side has the iconic strip in a black leather. At the back, we have the Vans logo stitched on. I like the majority of Vans that have the off the wall little tab there at the heel of the midsole. Uh, instead, it's stitched on. And you've got another bit of the Vans logo on the midsole, right there. The collar, there, it's very nicely padded, obviously. These are skate shoes, so they're gonna be protecting your ankles and giving you forms of comfort. The mid, the, sorry, the insole unit is ultra cush, so that's Vans' foam to keep your feet nice and comfy. Obviously, you guys will be hitting a lot of drops on your skateboard, so it's the best that you get the underside of your feet protected and make sure that they're comfy. That rounds up my review. I can't wait to try these on. I love Vans here, and so do the guys here at One Up Reviews. So roll out footage of me trying these fair lanes on. When it comes to the fit guys, I recommend that you get half size down to what you usually wear for Vans. Feels like my heels coming up a lot. I don't feel that I've got any lockdown support. It feels a bit wider as well when I try them on. My toes are where they need to be, but it doesn't feel like they fit. 
Other than that, these look really cool on. Very nicely padded on the underside of my foot. Obviously these were built for skating, so I can understand why they should be relatively shock absorbent. Which is cool. And it's a nice colorway as well, black, white and black. Pretty decent. Thanks guys for watching, remember to like, comment and subscribe, follow us at 1UP Reviews with Z at the end. Until next time, peace.